Hello everyone, I'm Yang Do Guan, Senior Director at Anco Technology. Also, I'm Team Development Program Manager. And today, I, I will present some information on High Performance Team for Leaded Fleet BJ product. In this agenda, on section one, I will show you semiconductor device and package trend for leaded fleet BGA product. On section two, I will explain why team is important. And then on section three, I will summarize the findings of what I, I will present to you today. This section will cover to understand what the challenges are on semiconductor device and package trend. This slide shows semiconductor technology research from Northeastern University, showing the CPU and GPU transistor density trend. You can see the trend of both CPU and GPU transistor count by year. So we recognize that both row is still valid as their transistor density continues to increase annually. We also see the base clock speed and die size are increasing steadily as well. Also, power density is another trend of a semiconductor device that must be considered. Junction temperatures are important to operate a semiconductor device reliably, but the power trend is outpacing the power requirement. Especially the logic static power trend has increased dramatically. So the main concern appears to be how to keep lower junction temperatures for decreasing load size. Let's move to Fleet BJ product trend. As we have seen, the semiconductor technology node is continuously decreasing. In the case of a single die Fleet BJ, recent die sizes are larger than 650 millimeter square. In addition, I think the largest die size maybe close to reticle size. The other development of 2.5 module Fleet BJ which is composed of SOC and several HBM memory dies. The module size is being increased as well because more memory is required. A short interconnection among several semiconductor devices is necessary to provide a better electrical performance. And the die quantity of advanced system in packaging Fleet PJ product is increased with a dense die interconnection. Based on this trend, we may be concerned about increasing package summer stress. The advanced fleet BJ packaging needs heterogeneous integration technologies to reduce the package body size with a higher die density. This is the key for near future business of advanced system package for fleet BJ product. Heterogeneous integration technologies have two different passes of a fine interconnection base, substrate technology and RDL interposure. This result in the challenges how to make an efficient summer dissipation for 
reliable product operation. And how to apply the proper package reliability test conditions for qualifying the in heterogeneous integrated packages. This slide shows a good case study of a summer simulation with the high power dice AR on module. There's two cases. In case one, 250 watt for CPU dice are located at package center. In case two, each CPU is placed at package corners. You can see which one is better in terms of thermal dissipation. On this result, I can tell the spacing between high power that can significantly impact the temperatures. Realistically, high power die should still not be placed too near package corners. This is the issue, how to keep the junction temperatures needed for reliable product operation. So a higher summer conductivity team is very important for advanced system in packaging PGBJ product. This section will be focused on team summer performance for needed PGBJ. This slide shows why team is important. There is two trend, SEPTA system to ambient is less than 0 0.05 degree C per watt. Die power density is uh, higher than 0.5 watt per millimeter square. Based on this trend, the cooling system is being changed to a high performance cooling system. SETA JC is very significant factor in the high performed cooling system. I will focus on Timon on the next slide because Timon is an important portion of SETA JC. Summer bulk conductivity of Tim is measured and provided by Tim suppliers. In the table on the left, you can see each model summer conductivity values. The higher team summer conducti conductivity team model started symbol A, B, C, D, E as the order in higher. In addition, the summer bulk conductivity is measured not same methodology for all suppliers. So SETA JC measurement is the solution to know the actual thermal performance in the package. This slide shows SETA JC values measured with 60 body thermal test vehicle of the leaded bridge BJ with 25.6 mm square die. The table on the left, too, the first column is team each team model and different assembly number. On the second column, there is some SETA JC A value for each. Based on this uh, measured SETA JC A value with different team and process number condition, I want to explain team summer performance is not derived from the team summer conductivity value. For example, team model B is a higher summer conductivity team than team model C. But model C has 
lower theta JCA value on the measurement than model B. Also, the other one, model F. This team model F was assembled with different process condition number two and number three. In the case of number two process, the theta JCA value lower than with process number three. Also, this is a very good result to understand about team summer performance on the package. I will explain more details on the next slide. Team model app shows very interesting result. First of all, I want to explain some more instance of team one equation on the left. Summer conductivity and die size are fixed in the designed package. So only BLT and interfacial summer contact distance value is will be changed with different lead attached process. So evidence is uh, on the right. The table shows different process number, tab is process number two, bottom is number three. Also the BLT is different. Uh, with the process number two, BLT is a thinner than the process number three. Also this BLT is matched for theta JCA measured value. The other one is uh, this SAT image. For two different lead attach process, we can see different PLT SAT images. This means the different process made different PLT image, also different PLT thickness, which impact to total Timor summer resource value. The other case study is for uh, team BLT and team die coverage issue of assembly. In the case of team model D, the summer conduct conductivity value is uh, higher than the other aluminum base, aluminum pillar base, the polymer team. But uh, on the SETA JCA value, uh, the value is really not lower than what we expected. That's the reason you can see the three different uh, SAT image on the table. Also, each SAT image has different BLT and void ratio. To get the higher team die coverage, we needed the thicker BLT in the case of team model D. This is the reason we didn't get lower than uh, the other uh, polymer team SETA JCA on the measurement. On this section, I would like to explain how to select the best team correctly for customer product qualification. Many team suppliers introduce new teams. MCO uses a new team screen flow. This slide shows the flow step by step. The most important step is to confirm the team summer performance by measuring the SETA JC. 
with a standard test vehicle after confirming the team assembly quality. As previous explained, assembly quality is critical to confirm new team because the team on VLT sickness and the interfacial team contact resistance value are dependent on its assembly quality. Again, theta JC measurement is needed to know the actual summer performance of a team in the package. This slide shows how to select team correctly as a team one for customer product qualification. Team one summer license of package SETA JC measurements in a well controlled lab are essential. As a result, we can quickly correctly select the best team for customer product qualification using our summer test capability. In closing, I would like to summarize what I presented today. Semiconductor device and package trend show transition and ice power densities are still increasing yearly. Decreasing node size continues and requires low junction temperatures for reliable product operation. And to keep a lower SETA JC is important. T1 is an important factor for reducing SETA JC. Team thermal conductivity is an indicator only of expected T1 thermal performance of a package because team thermal performance relies on assembly. In addition, we needed to confirm the team thermal performance on the T1 set thermal SETA JC measurements. MCO has the capability to provide actual summer performance using summer test die and realistic package assembly. MCO continues continually accesses the market for the best teams available and skilled assembly know-how to complement them. Thank you for your time and attention.